Welcome to Module 18 for PowerPoint 2016. In this module, you will inspect and proof your final presentation, learn how to preserve and protect the presentation's content, and export it to other formats. Let's say we have a misspelling on our Antarctica 1991 to 2016 slide. These are shown with a wavy red underline. The word author is misspelled. One option to make your corrections is to right-click the word author. You will see a list of possible spelling corrections appear. In the list, click author and the correction is made to the text on this slide. Another option is to click on the review tab on the ribbon and click to select spelling in the proofing group. The spelling task pane opens and the spelling feature finds and flags the next misspelled word. As you are checking the content on each slide, you may need to use the built-in thesaurus in PowerPoint. Select a word. On the Review tab, click Thesaurus, found in the Proofing command group, to bring up the thesaurus task pane, displaying a list of terms related to the word you have selected. Another thing to consider is if your teacher has a different version of PowerPoint. You will want to save the presentation in a version that your teacher can view and access to the slideshow content and make sure that any personal information from your computer is what you want stored in the data files properties. If your PowerPoint presentation is in Office 2016, but you need to share the file with your teacher who uses PowerPoint 2003, save it in PowerPoint 97 to 2003 format from the Save As dialog box. One option to work with compatibility issues is to check the file for compatibility problems before you turn it in to your teacher. The compatibility checker will recommend fixes that may help you determine what you want to do next. Click the File tab and then click Check for Issues and a menu appears. Click Check Compatibility. The Microsoft PowerPoint Compatibility Checker dialog box opens. It has found a few potential compatibility issues. Click OK and the dialog box closes. You can share your presentation in another format other than PowerPoint. To save your PowerPoint presentation in a different format, begin by clicking the File tab and then click to select Export. Here, you will be able to select the format for the export and follow the prompts to complete the export process. If you ever need to password protect a file, start by clicking the File tab and then click Protect Presentation to view the menu of choices. Click Encrypt with Password to open the dialog box. In the Password box, type your chosen password. Click OK and another dialog box appears that will ask you to confirm the password. Type the exact same password again and click OK.